evening our viewers and welcome again to the five minutes with Zikta. Today as we close off the year, you know, this is a festival season. First of all, I like obviously to pay my dues to Southern Sun Ridgeway for ever hosting us in this program and it's been fantastic. Today, I have got a veteran with me, somebody who is known on the scene and we've just come from a very important summit and we'll be touching on that a little bit. Just to introduce him, Ladies and gentlemen, I would want you to welcome Mr. Christopher Chilongo, an advisor and consultant for We Create Zambia. Welcome to the program. Thank you, Miofea. Uh, we are delighted to be here, and good evening, Zambia. Definitely. A lot of people would want to understand, what is this We Create Zambia? Why are we recreating it? What is it about? It's a center for the women to access resources, education for economic empowerment. It's a U.S. government-supported project in partnership with the Airweb and Caterpillar Foundation and Griffith Works of the U.S. Too many people involved. Why? Why the woman? Why? Well, it has been realized that a woman is a special force and that by the numbers, these women can be you know, empowered with entrepreneurial skills and they can make a change in this world. The Zambia Entrepreneurship Summit, wonderful stage. You, you were on point and and we partnered with you guys to have a certain segment looking at how agriculture is affected by IT. Well, first and foremost, thank you very much to Zikta to, uh, for, the, for, for, for coming to, to the table, to be with us into the summit and collaborating, and, and indeed for uh, being lead discussant in the thematic topic, which was talking about how technology can help agriculture. And, and, and in that, we are so glad that the, the, the summit brought thousands of upcoming entrepreneurs. And obviously, as you saw yourself, Mafia, into your thematic session, and the country itself putting agriculture on top there, we think we create should be an incubation center to get technology to access people who can develop this country. Obviously, you're talking about incubation, and you know Zikta is going big on incubation. So I obviously, from that program, we did do a lot of sitting and start looking at you guys being uh, maybe the front runners, you are the experts, we are the regulators. And definitely we, we see a, a phenomenon, you know we run the ICT, uh, Girls in ICT program because we want to bring a lot of women into this sector. We want them to play a major, major role. And we hope you as an advisor and a consultant on the market will definitely be one of our mentors. For sure, we, we, we think uh, Zikta is a partner and we think uh, technology is cutting across and therefore for the women in Zambia we know for a fact that um, we need to push the agenda for digital literacy and we know for sure that Zikta is setting up centers to promote innovation into technology. We want to work with Zikta to push that. If you are targeting the girl child, we are also targeting the girl child and the women. We think we should collaborate with Zikta and have centers where our women can be digitally educated. You know what, Christopher, one, is, one of the interesting aspects is in your personal capacity, how do you see ICT sitting in the ambience of Zambian development? Remember, the president has always emphasized and talked about smart Zambia. Right, we are glad to hear that uh, His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Zambia, Mr. Edgar Chagualugu, has set the tone and is saying e-commerce, e-governance, and those are the issues we should be gra grappling with. We know for sure that the Center for Excellence for Technological Advancement in Zambia has been set up, and we are happy to hear that, and therefore we are going to support all those efforts. For us, as we create Zambia Center, we are already on that agenda. We are getting our women to come to our center, to be exposed to digital skills of how they can develop their websites, how they can use their mobile phones, to do all sorts of things you can do with a smartphone. So we want to be part of the agenda for a smart Zambia, for a developed Zambia by 2064. Big Chris would want to continue talking all the way with you. It's always endless, but we have a documentary that we're working on and people like you, We Create Zambia and other partners that will be, will be in this documentary to be a 30 minutes program and we're asking our you know, viewers out there to actually look forward to this documentary. But today, I just wanted us to touch on the We Create Zambia and the Zambia Entrepreneurship Summit. Second, in addition that we had, and believe you me, there were a lot of women and men. And in the agriculture session that we're talking about, Boy, didn't we see a lot of women who are proper business people. The ICT is working for the Zambian people. Do not be left out. With Zikta, 
you can surely come to us and we can share a number of things that we are doing. Moreover, the ZDA are one of those people that we are partnering with, so meaning the sky is the limit. End of the year, happy season, and we'll see you next year.